Darn. Are you kidding me? A criminal serving a life sentence just escaped from Metro Police. I ordered everyone to keep quiet about this, but it's only a matter of time before the press sniffs this out. We need to get number 89 back before then. No keyhole for it. Same as you, Date. What do you mean by that? I really like chairs. They look... Delicious. What the hell are you talking about? So now you're ogling me too? <laughs> okay. I'll stop. Date, pewter. Once we're done here, let's pop that bottle. Not a bad idea. But when the boss gets drunk, she has the tendency to crush balls. In that case, perhaps we should never solve this case. Wait a minute, did you let number 89 escape on purpose? So that you could catch the bigger fish? Y yeah, boss. Exactly. I was kidding. That's nostalgic. When I was a kid, I used to put a broom between my legs and pretend to be a witch. Spiking is an important part of volleyball. Hmm. Spiking. Spike... Spike tune? What is that?
A shogi player gave that to me. I think his name was... Hanyu? The Hanyu? Yep, that's him. If you had the power to stop time, what would you do? Do you even have to ask? Your heart rate is increasing rapidly. I want to knock you over the head with that snowboard right about now. Then allow me to say this. I will slalom away from that attack. Not funny. Date, look! A UFO? That's a symbol. Boss, I turned your stationary bike into a coffee grinder. You use the pedals to grind the beans. Why the hell did you do that? were kind and had a big smile. Such a shame. Reminds me of your ex, Date. It shouldn't. Punched out an officer and stole his clothes. He put on the uniform and brought me with him at gunpoint. Well, he had the gun in his pocket, uh, hiding it. No one on the floor even knew this was happening. He got on the elevator and made it to the ground floor. He even stole my security card. He said he'd kill me if I tried anything. I suppose the whole escape took him about uh, five minutes. He must have planned this. You're rather calm about all this. I'm coming down from being terrified for my life. I'm in a bit of a fugue state right now. Number 89 still has it. But don't worry. I have a spare. I'll give it to you later. Oh. 
How would I know? After he got to the exit, he let me go. I didn't see where he went. I collapsed right there. Don't you have something to say? I know an apology isn't gonna fix it, but I know I'm responsible for this. I'll get in. Well then, good luck. Date, I know you are already aware of this, but there are security cameras all over this compound. I checked all of them. Number 89 fled in a car that was waiting for him. So he had an accomplice? Yes. Did you see who was driving? I did. Who was it? You and I know him well. Renju? Renju? Why? Date, Moma is calling. Moma? From the Kumakuras? I'll connect him. Hey, Date. I just got the word. Renju's been seen. What? Where? Hey, don't forget our deal. Deal? What deal? You forgot already? I'm talking about Tessa. Oh, right. I'll be waiting. You know what to do. What should we do? We have no choice. We have to take her. To MoMA? Yes. Gosh! Late, 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 late. You're late. I'm going home. Never! Have you forgotten the vows you exchanged? Are you drunk? No, of course not. You're drunk. I kid, 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 kid. I'm kidding! I can't believe I'm gonna shovel forge with you. I'm getting excited! We are not shovel forging. I was talking about the date, silly. Shovel forge and a date are synonymous, apparently. So where are we going? To meet the dragon. The dragon? Like that dragon? Yeah. Oh, I get it. Like a fantasy world with swords and magic. And you're gonna teleport me there. syndicate building, right? Yeah, the Kumakuras. And you were trying to make me believe this was some kind of fantasy world? No. That's what you thought. What? Date lied to me! Date, you bastard! You made Tessa cry! M Mister, save me! Throw this man into Tokyo Bay! Got it! I'll have him sleeping with the fishes. 
This is an interesting turn of events. I can hardly believe it. Moma, I held up my end of the deal. You sure did! You want to hear about Renju? Mr. Okiura? Hey, Tessa! Let's have a party! No thanks. Lanterns. Hey, Iris. What do you think of when you see two lanterns pushed together? Huh? I mean, it kind of looks like something, right? Uh, not really. No, no, really. Picture two lanterns pushed together, and you put your face between them. There's something that reminds you of? Lanterns. What, you mean boobs? Damn it, MoMA. You're not supposed to say it. Tessa, if you're tired, you can sit on my desk. On your desk? How many cows did they kill for this? Uh, it's a fake? Gate, look! A UFO! That's an ashtray.
Sorry for bringing you here. I it's okay. You don't have to be scared, Tessa. We're not thugs. We're just a gang. About as contradictory as meatless beef. The old boss was really violent. He would take a cheese grater to someone's leg if they looked at him funny. But after I took over, we went crystal clean. Crystal? Methamphetamines. No, we don't do drugs. We don't deal with that stuff. We had to restructure the whole operation. Cut a lot of people off. Cut? Their throats. No, not like that. Oh yeah, I haven't introduced this old man yet. I'm 24! Mama is lying. He is at least 48. Absolutely. Sorry for not introducing myself. My name is Moma Kumakura. I work for a prestigious advertising agency. You run the Kumakura gang, right? You're like a mob boss. How did you know that? Is he stupid? Moma may not look it, but he's a huge ASET fan. Well, I mean, I don't know if I'm a huge fan. Gambling. Bet, debt, ASET! Worries. Uh, forget, fret, ASET! Now what does she say? ASET, you bet! Wow, my catchphrase! Thank you! <laughs> this, this is kind of embarrassing. But sorry, Moma. I don't like gangsters. <gasps> I don't like gangsters either. Gangsters are awful. All those nasty Yakuza guys should drop dead, am I right? <laughs> What happened to Mr. Opira? I heard he escaped the hospital. So did I. But I don't know anything more than that. Please tell me! Hold up. What were you saying about Tessa's dead body? Oh, well... Date saw a parallel world with my dead body in it! A parallel world? Never heard of it? Oh, yeah! Of course I have! Yeah, yeah, right! Parallel worlds and all that shit. Yeah! I don't understand it, but I suppose he does. Good. I don't feel like explaining it. But why would Mr. Okira do that? I don't know. He could be a hostage or an accomplice. Hmm. Either way, I need to find him. You said on the phone that you saw Renju. Yeah, I had all my people looking for him. So, tell me where he is. Hmm, I could... Hey, I held up my end. I brought Iris like you asked. Date, come here. Date, I don't quite know how to ask this, but... Can you ask Tessa if I can shake her hand, please? Oh, that's it? Sure.
Iris, could you do me a favor? A favor? He, uh, he wants to see your boobs. What the fuck, dude? I didn't say that! Oh, sorry. What I meant was, he wants to shake your hand. Oh, a handshake. Sure! I would never show my boobs. Dante, this is the happiest day of my life. It feels good to be the boss. So how about it? All right, here it goes. Renju was seen in two places. First, Sunfish Pocket, the maid cafe. Second, Ikume Shrine. Sunfish Pocket and Ikume Shrine. Got it, thanks. No problem, bro, really. Why do you care? Can I have it? What? Can I have the ring? Why would I give it to you? Hey, can I have the ring? Absolutely, of course you can. Here, take it. Wait, 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 no. I, I can't give you this. You're so cheap. Come on, it's not like you're losing it. It's exactly like I'm losing it. <laughs> Aww. You guys are a good team. Like siblings. They're out. Looking for Renju. Besides, I can't have them here seeing me like this. Good point. Anyway, Moma, take care of Iris for me. What? What? Wait! You're leaving me here? You'll be safe with him. <laughs> Are you serious? Look at his face! Not to mention he runs a crime syndicate. What if he sells me to the highest bidder? Tessa, I would never do that! I told you, we're clean now. We all go home on time, we follow government regulations. See ya. Wait! What about Shovel Forge? I told you, I never promised to play with you. But you promised me a date! D Dante! Is this true? You son of a bitch. I'm gonna ignore that. Good idea. Date, you're gonna look for Mr. Okiura, right? Take me with you. If you do, I'll tell you about last night. Her late night visitor. Fine. Dante, don't ignore me! A clean gang? Oh, that's just a toy. Oh, just a toy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's leave them alone for a while. We have two places to check. Sunfish Pocket and Ikume Shrine. I want to go to the warehouse, too. Where you found my dead body. Something bothering you? No, I'm just curious. Oh, and one more thing. Can we eat somewhere? Food sounds good. I haven't eaten in a while. Oh, my chest hurts. Getting hard to breathe. 